So this is the main screen, the first screen of our game called Il Budget, which is very simple. It shows a start button and a logo. First, user is um, instructed on what the game is all about. So basically, it's about um, using the money you earn from your job, which is a mini game, um, which uh, we will have to make decisions on spending, saving, etc., etc. And the salary will be based on your performance in the small mini game. So you have to find a balance between work, social life, money, and happiness because happiness will also be a factor in the game. And every time where you play the game, it will be like three years have passed, so you will get the salary for three years, and you will have to make decisions on that. It's important that you always have some money saved up for unknown uh, expenses which you have not planned for. So you will start off with 10,025 happiness. So if, um, if we go here, you can see that there are four main menus, one for items, plans, um, funds, and social menu. We'll start off with the items menu and there's the clothes menu. So right now we can buy for ourselves. So we can buy basically any type of clothes. So we can just buy. The money lowers, the happiness increases. So that's the that's what always happens when you buy something. It will deduct your funds and increase your happiness. There are some gadgets, um, some house appliances and vehicles which we don't have enough money yet to buy. So the button is grayed out. Next, we can go to plans. So we have two options, going out or traveling. When going out, we have um, the prices for all the family. So basically, if in the future you have children, as we will see, you can in the social menu, the total will be higher than 10 euro. It will be the respective total for all the family. Um, there are different dining options and activities, so you can go to the cinema and everything. And um, for traveling, it's the same thing basically, it will go up according to your family. So then we have the funds menu. So here we can go to the bank where you can make a term deposit, which will, um, you will get an output amount according to the number of years you keep your deposit in and obviously the amount you deposit. So that will increase accordingly here. And also pension schemes. So basically the pension schemes, um, First, you can read more information on the Maltese pension, where um, it will inform you on the maximum pension amount you can receive and uh, um, the two thirds of your usual salary. But you also have information on the private pension schemes, where it tells you that you will get a 25% tax rebate for up to 500 euros per year. Now, this information is presented um, in a gamified way up here where you can invest this amount and you will get a tax rebate. So basically, if I increase the amount per year, I will get a higher tax rebate until I reach the maximum amount per year for a tax rebate. So obviously, the higher I go, it still remains 500 if I exceed the 2000 mark so you can invest for example i will start investing the minimum amount so in the socials menu we can choose to enter a relationship once we enter a relationship we have an option to get married however we don't have enough funds for now as it will cost 20k and here we have the happiness of our significant other who also has an inventory. Now we are also able to buy items for our significant other. So there's an option to buy not for yourself, but for your significant other. 
So if we go back to the socials menu and go on our significant other's inventory, we can find the item we have bought for her. And also, um, we can see that the happiness has increased. Um, in plans, we can now see that the amounts have increased according to the number of if we try to buy something for which our funds will lower significantly below a certain threshold we will get the error some other interesting features which this game contains are the use of apis where we have a pricing api which configures the prices of all the items which user can buy and the naming api which gives random names to to the children which you can choose to have